Okay, so what I'm doing currently is setting up the open broadcast software so that it will correctly record Need for Speed Worlds, because the last time I did it, it recorded a black screen, because apparently and with maximized games, um, your monitor is black, and the game doesn't actually replace your monitor, so you have to load the game first and have it open in the background so that I can see if I can get it to record the game instead. Right now it's loading. Saw that, but uh, yeah, I had to change some Steam settings so that I didn't have any. Well, so that my friends had a request before they view what I'm doing. It would really suck if my computer started running two broadcasts at once. I would tank my computer. Okay. To see because there's a noticeable time delay. Not quite sure how this works. I can always try running this in windowed mode. That would then paste it on the monitor instead of on instead of on top of or over or instead of the monitor. Let's see if that works. It's supposed to be in window mode. I'm going to lower the resolution. Okay, well, this is appears to be working, so I'm just going to go with this. So, um, I'm making this video, um, because as of the middle of July or something like that, this game will no longer exist. Yeah. Using my screen resolution. And since I'm not sure if they're going to release a single player to allow those of us that have spent real money on the game to you know, continue using all real money stuff, I need to record as much as I can so that I can remember, you know. Well, everything my money went towards. I am leaving for Canada on my mission on Tuesday. Well, I'm going to Utah first, but tomorrow will be the last day that I get to play this game. So I'm going to miss the big finale, unfortunately.
game doesn't normally lag, but running a uh, recording in the background does tax my rather weak system a bit. I may have to lower settings to compensate. I don't want to lower settings because I'm already on medium quality. If I lower any further, it'll look like crap. See if I can get one of my more tech savvy friends to explain to me how to get it to work on full screen, but until then, I'm gonna have to do it wounded. Because I didn't look kind of try to fight. It's rather odd talking to myself. I'm sure I'll get any of this when I get back. When I get back, I plan on buying a nicer computer, and then doing this for fun, uh, recording, Maybe make my own YouTube channel, more professionally, nothing like, you know, on the scale of Vanos Gaming or PewDiePie, but, you know, it's something so I can record my experiences. You know, you know, you know how you always wish, you know, you could go back and play a game again. You know, if you record yourself playing the game for the first time, you can go back and kind of relive playing the game for the first time. I guess. Probably what started the whole record yourself playing thing. I doubt it was originally a make money scheme. Decide if I'll upload this to YouTube before I go. I'll upload it to YouTube. And then in two years when I get back, I'll see how many uh, hits I get on my uh, no name channel. <laughs> it ends up a lot, obviously. And if I do upload this, I'll just. I won't have enough time to edit it. So I'll just upload the raw footage and. Put a disclaimer at the beginning. There's something saying that, you know, this is raw footage, I didn't have time to edit it before I left. So it's, uh, getting a pretty terrible quality. Skilled and I'm gonna race. Because <laughs> I'm rather dreadful at races, I normally stick to uh, treasure hunts and the police escapes. Big open, non restricted uh, areas.
in the song from I never understood why cars went down this uh, trolley tunnel, but they do. on this free to play game. This car alone probably cost $10. Not more. Oh, there it is. Oh, that little corner that I skipped over. Doing. I'm switching cars. This is the uh, the third car I bought, um, and as an as my first and fastest car, well, originally fastest car, I used it originally for treasure hunts, so I upgraded it for treasure hunts to earn the extra money. And I haven't, you know, seen any reason to choose a different car. It doesn't really have any other purpose other than to look cool. While the game is ending, I'm going to revive streaks here for you soon. Okay. Now, they are giving away a car for free. You can buy it as many times as you want. So, all I'm going to do is I'm going to buy it. And they've been said you should probably do this to buy it so I can get the achievement. For a large number of via the oh boy. In case you didn't see up at the top left corner, it says how many cars I own. The purpose is to get 150 earn achievement. Um, gets you yeah, a nice Koenig Sig CCX. It'll also probably give me quite a few Mazda achievements. After this, I, well, I'm gonna play with friends later, and I uh, probably end up selling all of my craft cars that I've just gotten over the years for free from events or when you buy and you spend like $100. Spend more than like, uh, or, oops. When you spend a good deal of money it gives you like a free car pack and usually it just gives crap cars so. it's gonna be rather tedious um I may edit this portion because this will be really easy just to splice out this big segment I might keep any parts in there. Uh, more interesting.
Okay. So, after spending quite a bit of time buying a whole bunch of the same car, I am nearing the end as I approach 150. I don't know if when editing this I'll just splice out buying the cars or if I'll fast forward it. I'll just have to decide which I think is more dramatic. And now, I buy my 150th car. Also, in my recordings, if you hear noises in the background, it's probably my stepbrother being very loud. Whew, okay, now I buy the last one. Okay. Let's look at all the Mazdas I have. Scroll, scroll, scroll. Yep, so there they are. And this 151. Because a while back I bought a, a Hummer. Um, and it, but it was during a glitch, so the game didn't count that I owned the Hummer. So I have cheap and forgetting it or anything, so it's kind of annoying. Um, Platinum pack. I suppose this is pretty hard normally. Nice four star. Two two stars. Ten thousand. And. Koenigsegg CCX Achievement Edition. Oddly enough, this does not belong up on my most, uh, on my rarest achievements. All of these I got without cheating. <laughs> Um, but, uh, let's see if I can find... Legendary Driver. I almost have enough for this. We'll never get up to that. <laughs> Unfortunately. <laughs> This car handles. It does sound rather nice. It is very nice for an E class. Acceleration is lacking, but hey, it's an E class. Oof. High handling compared to high top speed means it does not slide well. I do not like that. I like to slide. Sliding is cool. I guess with a car like this, there's no need to slide, which means you preserve what little top speed you have. Let's go around this corner. Oh boy. Just corner rather sharply. I'm impressed. Too bad there aren't uh, higher tier cars that can do that. Let's make this. I had a slide. Good turning, but other than that, it pretty much sucks. Now, I'm gonna get out my new car, the CCX. I have the Agera, the uh, oh, I think I have to uh, go purchase it. Hmm. I it. Let's 
also at some point I will be selling all of my fluff cars, not the Mazdas that would take too long. I'll be selling all my fluff cars to rack up some more money so that I can get better stuff. Why not? I don't want to go to this class, maybe. No, oops, A class. Oh, actually. Codex A. Ah, oh, there's my CCX. It's actually pretty decent. I wonder if it's as good as my other Codex A. Kind of looks weird without the uh, thin fit on the back. Ooh. It does turn right there, though. As I approach and pass this classic car in my luxurious Swedish supercar, I have not driven a car like this in a while, at least my Pagani. Says this hand, the hand looks too high on this car. Ah! And I'm totally rubbish at this. I just said rubbish. It's a British word. Ooh, someone's gaining on me. It's the same muscle car. What? What? Oh, well, it doesn't help I keep crashing. Oh, I was in my Pagani. Or even my Aventador. I would him, or he would never have caught up to me. Let me see if I can see what kind of car he's driving. This, this is an A-class car, although I didn't check to see how high of an A-class. Time to go see what Ringing it is. Um, Switch cars. Wow, it's only 700. Iconic Seg. Got my very nice Agera. This is what I use for police pursuits because it's high top speed for handling. Pretty much the same car, except the gear, I think it's a little bit thinner, longer, got a nice fin on the back, and that says King. Put that there. But uh, basically the same car, no matter what it is. Um, gonna go to the car dealer. Buy some cars, see what they have uh, before I start wasting money on stuff like that. Okay, Alpha Romeo. Give DBS. Oh. I don't have the vintage anymore. Okay. I do own it on the data. Two audience actually. It would be nice to have gotten this from the museum. Uh, it's nice. Got terrible behind one I'm not sure how I would have liked driving it. Got one of these already. Don't have either of these. It's a decent pair of seat gloves. Let me get that. If I have enough money later on. Ooh, actually, a TTRS coupe. It's getting a bit it's getting a crap. Maybe a W, because I already have a bunch. I don't know if I've got a kind of I've got a kind of but this is a nice one. I would have liked to have gotten this one as well. It's pretty low. And it's pretty expensive, but um, 
hope this is 6, 0, 6. Was it a 0, 1? Alright, this. I can't keep my eyes straight. Questions, do I have a charge? I do. And this would have been a nice car. I've gotten as well. It was a nice police car. It's a fake one. I have a Viper in my other account, so I'll just keep it in. I love to back in one of these. These things are massive behemoths. Maybe a GT. I don't know what point they See, I bought the, uh, oh, well, I bought this Hummer, I bought this one, when I tried to make it canon, canon, it didn't work. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah, I uh, mistakenly said this was the first SUV, when in reality the first SUV that it had was... They don't consider a Hummer an SUV, even though it is. This is the, the good CCX edition. And you just got all out splurge on Lambos. I never did buy a Lotus. Maybe, oh, there's no release for sale. Maybe an Exige. Maybe I'll buy one. Just for fun. In fact, I have enough money to get another one of those. Lost to speed 30. Why would you buy this for 200? You could buy the cooler one. It's just as good with the same stats for free. Oh, I would have liked to have had this one too. Only because it's one of the few cars that can be my Pagani. <laughs> I would have liked to have this one just for collectors. Have one of these. Don't have one of these. Would have liked that for collectors as well. Actually, gonna buy one of these right now as I'm scanning. Because I've wanted one of these for a while, but they've. Uh, Always been rather expensive. So there's this one. I have a machine gun. It's green camo. This one's got white. Let me see if I'm not sure. I like the green one better. Not cool. There's a depth machine gun. Purchase that. Oh. Unfortunately, they're not worth anything. Hopefully, I keep the car slot that it came with. It did. Okay, good. Hoping I wouldn't have to spend whatever mediocre amounts it would have cost to bought it. Because at this point, you buy car slots for one, but. I'd rather keep what little I have left. And I still have a million. to have bought a 370Z, but the ones in this game just don't, don't seem right. They're not shaped correctly, probably because it was the 
the um, I use the I can't think I used the concept car version I think which meant that it was dreadfully inaccurate to what it should have looked like and here's my car 2000 right now I spent quite a bit more money in that buying line but it seems plain and simple this is the Zonda F predecessor bunch of Porsche I'd have liked to bought the Boxster just because I like Boxsters Time to see how well my new SUV drives. I like this car. I should have gotten it sooner. It's got a machine gun on top. That's pretty awesome. Anyone else? Oh, that wasn't the other side. That was more of the underneath. Or 360 degree. Oh, why couldn't I have gotten this car sooner? This car's amazing. I love the beast and team escapes. Okay. Um, I'll be on with friends later. But they don't really care about cars, so I'll just sell cars now. Let's see how much money I get. Go back to party a little before I start selling stuff. So we can drop around in cars and you know, talk about them. Use this the order. Oh, um, just go lowest to highest. That doesn't work. The most is in the e-class. And here we've got my Dodge Charger. I bought this car. Only so that I could play with my new friends who also had E classes. However, it's a lot slower than the no, than the default E classes. So, it was perfect because my friends aren't very good at racing games. I only made them play just, you know, because the game's ending and they took pity on me. Let's go to 130. Um, I guess it's not that bad. It does reach its top speed a lot quicker than the uh, other cars I own? It's a plus. I'm gonna sell this car because I don't need it now that I've got the most. They're uh, pretty even to what my friends have. Should have waited to get to top speed before I did that. Oops. So, Dodge Charger RT. It's nice to have you. You've been a good car. Oh, I'll change cars first. Before we sell it, let's change it to the next E Class car on my list.
Oh, that's right, that's my only E car. E class car. Okay, so D class. I'm not gonna mess with D class because my friends have E and D, so I don't know which of these I'm gonna need. I'll go to C class next. Bought this car just because. Um, I could. I think I got an achievement for that. Um, car dealer. I'm not, I'll keep my cars. Um, I'll play with my friends later tonight. Um, and then I'll come back tomorrow and sell all my stuff. Or later on tonight after I'm finished playing with them. So it's, uh, it's been nice. This is my first video. Let's see how the editing goes. Probably not very well, but hey, till next time.